The Empire State Building, tallest in the world, and a must for tourists, including Princess Margaret and Lord Snowden. A trip to the top was on the schedule for the royal couple as they concluded their tour of America in New York. After almost 5,000 miles of sightseeing, socializing, and spreading goodwill for Britain, the princess and her husband look forward to a deserved rest, but not before visiting the United Nations headquarters. The Secretary General, Ruth Hunt, greeted them. The memorial to Dag Hammarskjöld, the former Secretary General, tragically killed in an air crash four years ago, was among the special points of interest. As the Princess and Lord Snowden left the United Nations, they had yet another official engagement to fulfill, this time at the Waldorf Astoria, where they were guests of honor at a glittering ball. The Princess was radiant, obviously enjoying herself. It wasn't long before her sparkle cast an informal atmosphere over the occasion. Throughout their strenuous tour, the Princess and her husband have been excellent ambassadors for Britain. The American people and their press have warmed to the couple, enchanted by the natural display of charm and friendliness.